Hey, a very good Friday evening, everybody. Happy weekend to you. And if it's your spring break, a very happy spring break as well. We've got some changes for your weekend forecast. More showers, more thunderstorms through your Saturday. Then a cold front comes in. The rain is gone, but the temperatures are dropping. We're only looking for highs in the mid to upper 50s for most. Breezy as well. Winds coming in from the north and the east, 10 to 20 miles per hour. Let me show you a pinpoint forecast as we go through the rest of your evening. We could see some couple more thunderstorms blow into our southeastern counties, and if we can, that would leave rain in parts of the Brazos Valley through about 10, 11 o'clock this evening. It's not a great chance, but it is possible. Tomorrow morning, we start with some rain moving in from the southwest. The central and southern half of the area has the best chance for rain and thunderstorms. That clears by early evening, but as that cold front we were talking about approaches from the north, it may push a few more showers to a couple thunderstorms into the Brazos Valley. Severe weather, not widely anticipated. Most of the stronger activity that may try to pop up on us, 30, 40 mile per hour winds hail to the size of peas or slightly bigger, but we could have a stray severe thunderstorm still as we go through our Saturday, something we need to monitor. So here's what we'll call it, 65 at 10 o'clock, cloudy with the chance for rain increasing across a better portion of the area. If we stay away from the rain long enough, we make it to the low 70s. If we don't, it's only in the upper 60s. 50s for your Sunday. Don't forget to set those clocks forward one hour. Monday, a secondary cold front comes on through. That's going to reinforce the 40s in the morning, 60s in the afternoon with more moisture, humidity, and maybe even more showers and thunderstorms arriving by your St. Patrick's Day Friday. Interactive pinpoint radar. It's up at kbtx.com. Should anything get a little rowdy over the weekend, of course, we'll keep you updated there. Any social media that we have, and of course, on air if need be. And until then, we'll have another update for you tonight on News 3 at 10. Enjoy your weekend. Enjoy your Friday evening. Catch you back here very soon.